Hello and welcome to TZ Gaming. Today I'll be bringing a second video from the Executioner range called the Justice Seeker. This is the alternate variant to the Blood Seeker as shown in the video before. Now the differences are not just cosmetic between the white hood and the different colored robes, but actually in gameplay wise you can see that the Justice Seeker prefers to use a bit more range especially the fact that the Enhanced Dwarven crossbow had Paralyze on it. It's very handy, as you saw with the first mob that was attacked there. He was Paralyzed, knocked to the ground, and I was able to cut that distance by running towards him and then using the Headsman's Axe. Now, not only is the Enhanced Crossbow used, but also the spell form of Paralyze, which, uh, when it hits, is very effective. Now, here, I was trying to hit this guy behind the stone, but in third person view, which was silly of me trying to do it, uh, was not able to hit him. It was either going over him or hitting the brick. But eventually it didn't matter because you are not cruxed by having to do this. This is just the optional way to play. Um, it is not essential. You will not die if you don't hit them. There is a margin of error in this build, which can allow for any kind of uh, errors from just basic aiming fault or, you know, being hit by 10 mobs at once. So. I had to change into the Enhanced Crossbow here, which has two types of enchants on it. It has the Paralyze enchant, as well as Soul Trap. Uh, and we're facing two archers, which it would have taken a long time to get to. So, as you can see here, I was trying to just hit kill the closest one. Uh, I managed to paralyze him, so he was knocked down and was not able to shoot me, and I was consequently not able to shoot him. So I started to work on the second uh, archer. Uh, the crossbow is very effective, I find, because it's always ready, so if you want to get that first shot off before you start your melee attack, I find it to be better than having a bow. Though a bow could work here as well, but in keeping with the theme. So here's the finishing blow, and that's the Justice Seeker's Justice delivered.